Hey guys, welcome to my Ocean One channel. I got a super quick video for you today because we got news and uh, it's a press release from Fisker. I'm just going to read it to you. Uh, the title says Fisker adds six new locations, three new dealer partner locations in California, and new locations in Missouri, Pennsylvania, and Guam. Now, Guam. I don't know about Guam, okay? Does most people ever know where Guam is on a map? You know, it's way over there, basically under Japan in the grand scheme of things. Uh, Fisker has added three new dealership partners locations in California, Lumen Fisker in Sacramento, and L.A. Fisker in West Covina. Fisker both in Los Angeles County. Fisker has added two additional U.S. dealer partner locations, uh, Fisker of Kansas, Missouri, and NEPA, NEPA maybe, NEPA Fisker of Forest City, Pennsylvania, and Fisker Guam, a distributor in Guam. Fisker has signed agreements for 12 dealer partners, locations, and distributors in the U.S. and U.S. territories. Now, that's the first time we've ever seen U.S. territories that I'm aware of because that's what Guam is. Now, I wish we had started these dealers much sooner you know here we are late in the game signing up dealerships but we are signing them up so maybe this is showing signs of life in Fisker guess I should shut the sunroof up guess I got a police or an ambulance going by or something there I wish we'd start these dealerships much much sooner instead of waiting so late in the game and trying to pivot uh, now I want to read this quote from the Fisker spokesperson this is from whoever the spokesperson was. I don't know. Maybe Eric. I don't know. We are excited to welcome our new dealer partners to the Fisker family and look forward to them opening for business. California is an exceptionally important market for us, and our team has been working hard to sign dealership partners in the state. We are also very pleased to grow our national networks as we add another key Midwestern city, Kansas, Kansas City, Missouri, as well as new locations in Pennsylvania and Guam. Now, what what should we make of this? I am not so sure what to make of this, if you want the truth. Um, I don't think you're going to find a big, bigger Fisker fan than I am. I mean, I want Fisker to survive. And if this in any way helps us to survive, I am all for it. The one that I am just totally perplexed on, though, is Guam. Um, I had a person on uh, one of my feeds. Well, I guess I should just say not feeds. uh uh, what was it? Stock Twits. Had a personal Stock Twits message me and said he knows people in Guam and says that the speed limit there is just 35 miles per hour. And I looked that up. I was shocked. That That's actually correct from what I found on Google. And I was thinking, oh my gosh, if the speed limit's there, 35, people in these Fisker Oceans are going to be getting like, you know, six, 700 miles driving 35 miles per hour. I mean, I, I competed in the Fisker Challenge, okay? I, I, I know this stuff. And, man, if you're driving that slow, I mean, you're just going to kill it with miles. But anyway, I don't know what to make of Guam. I am totally perplexed on that. Maybe you guys can reach out your thoughts and see what you can come up with. Uh, anyway, I wanted to do this quick video for you because I said I would try to keep you uh, informed the best that I could. I've been super busy recently, so I've not been putting a whole lot out. But I caught this this morning and wanted to uh, share it with you guys. All right, guys, if you're appreciating my content, just uh, sign up. Uh, hit the like button if you like the video. And until next time.